Minister for State Enterprise and Investments, William Duma, has expressed concern over the termination of the eight national pilots by Air New Guinea recently. William Duma says it has cost the government a lot of money to train pilots and they are assets to the country's airline industry. However, he also pointed out that the management of Air New Guinea decided to terminate them based on the com company's administrative process, something which the government has no say in. Rose Amos reports. Recently, Air New Guinea has terminated eight national pilots. The pilots were led to have been involved in the politically motivated nationwide stop work on the 18th of July, which calls for Prime Minister Peter O'Neill to step down from office. Air New Guinea says on that day it had experienced unusual increase of national pilots reported sick and were unable to attend work. This has caused a lot of inconvenience on the airline's operations. Management, after proper investigations, has decided to terminate them. Minister for State, Enterprise and Public Investments, Willem Duma says, is currently studying the reports provided by both the affected pilots and the airline company and will respond accordingly. Uh, that is uh, an issue that is uh, before me and... Uh, once uh, all the available information together with uh, the relevant legal advice uh, is available, I will then be able to uh, uh, take a view as to whether uh, the procedures employed by any Guinea management to determinate them was fair and proper. But uh, in the meantime, let us not forget the fact that uh, it is really a situation involving an employer and its employees. Once an employer decides that uh, its employee no longer is required for services there and it decides to uh, go to the step of go to the stage of uh, terminating uh, its employees then uh, we really have nothing much to, uh, to say but in my case I just need to be satisfied that the process that was in, invoked to terminate uh, our national pilots was fair and proper. Meanwhile, Air New Guinea management says the airline is recovering from the incident with all domestic and international flights operating as normal. Rose Amos, NBC National News, Port Mosby.